So this is what we're gonna make. This object right here. Now on the surface it appears just to be four cylinders. However, what this is, is a fidget toy that spins and the pieces are locked together in a way that allows you just to keep spinning. And what we're gonna do, we're going to figure out how to quickly make this in Fusion 360. So when I print it, it will print as one piece but retain the ability to spin and move freely without friction. So let's go ahead and make this movable fidget ring right now super quick. So let's go ahead and jump into Fusion. The first thing we're going to do is go to a front view. We're going to click C to draw a circle. We're going to draw it on this plane. We're going to start at the origin. We're going to make a series of circles and they're all going to begin from this origin. The first circle will be 19 millimeters. Hit enter. Hit C again. Make another circle from that same origin. This will be 30 millimeters. Make another circle. This time, this circle will be 31 millimeters. So you can see that circle is just a little bit bigger. Make another circle. This will be 42 millimeters. Make another circle. This circle will be 43 millimeters. Make another circle. This circle will be 54 millimeters. You can start to see the pattern. Make another circle. This circle will be 55 millimeters. And the last circle for this front area will be 66. Now, we're gonna make a rectangle. So we're gonna click R, but we're gonna go over to the right side on our sketch palette. This is gonna be a center rectangle. We're gonna make a rectangle that is the width of our outer circle, so it's 66. And it's going to have a height of 19. So it'll have a height that is the diameter of the first circle. Go ahead, enter, finish the sketch. Let's go ahead, rotate the camera to a top view. We're gonna make one more circle. We're gonna click on this plane right here. Go right to the center. This circle will be 19 millimeters, the same as our very first circle. Hit enter, finish the sketch. Now we're going to go to an isometric view so I can see all these rings here. We're gonna use a new tool called Sweep. So we go up to Create, we drop down, we find sweep. Sweep will allow us to go around a pattern, almost like a, a horse on a track. And we're gonna select the profile, but we're gonna hold control as we do it. We're gonna select this profile, that profile, that pro, this profile, and this profile. So there's gonna be four of them selected. My pathway, I'm going to go back and look at the top view. The pathway will be this last ring I created. And that's it. Click OK. There are my rings. If you plan on printing this, I would recommend a 0.2 layer height. And that's it. That is the fidget ring spinner.